burnt marks on the asphalt, landscaping bare. During a funeral for this to take place, it is odd. Remnants from an explosion can still be seen three weeks after a bomb was ignited at Mountain View Cemetery. August 23rd, during a funeral, Auburn police say a car pulled up. To where the vehicles were parked and actually a passenger got out, broke a window and placed a explosive device in the passenger seat. The bomb exploding the car. This video showing the fire destroy the car and spread to nearby trees. Auburn uh, city employees started going after that car uh, just to kind of see if they can get a license plate or anything that could identify the two suspects. The passenger who set off the bomb began shooting at the employees. It could have been a lot worse than what it was, so very thankful that no one was hurt. The victim's car a total loss and those burnt trees have since been removed. Now police are asking for help. What vehicle are you looking for? So witnesses described the vehicle to us as a black Acura RL. But as we've read in the comment section of the post we made, also the phone calls re we've received, I don't know if that's necessarily the case. The, pip the photos are really blurry. At this point, Auburn police say they're looking for any black sedan with no license plate. They've received many tips already, but nothing substantial. You know, all we can do is hope that someone recognizes this vehicle and calls in with a good tip. We don't know if that victim was specifically targeted. That passenger is described as a tall man and he was wearing a full black ski mask. It's not much of a description, but Auburn police say any type of tip helps in this case. Live here in Auburn, I'm Kristen Goodwillie, King 5 News.